Hi, I'm Dr. James Machino. ProScar, Avidart, and Flomax in the treatment of BPH or benign prostatic hyperplasia. How do those drugs work? Well, ProScar, Avidart, and Flomax are drugs that are used to treat enlarged prostate problems, as you know, also known as benign prostatic hyperplasia. ProScar and Avidart actually work the same way. They block the conversion of testosterone into a more dangerous type of testosterone called DHT or dihydrotestosterone. What does DHT do? Well, as it builds up, it causes the cells of the prostate to divide at a faster rate. And so when you have a greater, now you're going to have a greater number of prostate cells if you have the cells dividing too fast. So the prostate gland enlarges and produces enlarged prostate problems. Why does this happen? Well, after age 40, the enzyme that converts testosterone to DHT seems to be more aggressive. That enzyme is known as the 5-alpha reductase enzyme. So those drugs actually are 5-alpha reductase enzyme inhibitors. They block the conversion into DHT by interrupting the effect of that enzyme. The other thing to know is that DHT can build up uh, if you start to get more overweight as you get older because fat cells will make more estrogen and estrogen slows down the breakdown of DHT and hence that can raise DHT levels as well and increase your risk for prostate problems including prostate enlargement. So ProScar and Avidart inhibit the 5-alpha reductase enzyme uh, and decreasing the buildup of DHT and in doing that they can help to shrink the prostate down a little bit. The drug Flomax works differently. It, re it works on the, the nervous system to sort of relax the muscular wall around the neck of the bladder and the prostate gland. So if I, you can relax the muscular coat around the gland, there's less tension so urine can flow more easily. But, but uh, drugs like that tend to work on other aspects of the, of, the, of the vascular system as well. So they can cause a sudden drop in blood pressure and you get up out of a chair, you feel dizzy. They can cause fatigue and weakness. A lot of men don't like the feeling that they get on that. And there's other side effects. Even with you know, uh, drugs like ProScar, there are some side effects that men don't like in certain situations. What I want to point out is that there are dietary and supplementation practices that have been shown in, in peer-reviewed clinical studies that have been shown they can help prevent benign prostatic hyperplasia by interrupting the biological steps that lead to an enlarged prostate. Some of the supplements actually have been proven to reverse benign prostatic hyperplasia, reverse enlarged prostates when you have mild to moderate cases. And many of those active constituents in the foods and in the supplements have also blocked important biological processes that lead to prostate cancer. So that's really important because Prostate cancer is the second leading cause of cancer death in men in this part of the world. And so those supplements and natural agents have fewer side effects than the drugs, and they have very important anti-cancer properties, and they've been shown to reverse prostate enlargement. So the problem is that, you know, men need to know about this, and, and medical doctors really don't study a lot of nutrition and natural medicine in medical courses or in continuing education courses. And so they don't emphasize this enough. Even the the uh, prostate, uh, prostate Cancer Society, uh, during the month of November when they have their awareness campaign, they stress getting a PSA blood test to, to look for prostate cancer. A very good idea. But they don't stress enough the prevention strategies to prevent the development of prostate cancer and prostate enlargement. And that falls to lifestyle and dietary factors. How do we know? All the scientific evidence published in the Journal of the National Cancer Institute shows that up to 75% or maybe beyond that, 75% of, of cases of prostate cancer seem to be preventable if men will just use the right dietary and lifestyle measures. So because this is not being uh, taught by medical doctors in any significant way, I've created an ebook that's available right here, sort of you know, the natural remedies uh, in the treatment of benign prostatic hyperplasia, prostatitis, and also the prevention of prostate cancer. That's an ebook that every single man should get access to. It's available here. Download it right now and go through the booklet. It may actually save your life. Now remember at machinohealth.com, uh, you'll see my other research papers, other videos I've created. You'll see uh, live footage from my, from my professional seminars, resources, other downloads I have for you that will help you lead a long, healthy, functional life. All my research papers and my ebooks and uh, 
the uh, teaching materials that I have have all the scientific references in them. So you'll no always know you're getting sound scientific information from me, the most evidence-based, most up-to-date information available on any health topic that you're looking for. So you should really make MachinoHealth.com an ongoing, reliable resource for health and wellness information for both you and your family members. Thanks so much for watching. Thank you.